this guy. Oh, yes. You guys are the little kids. Very funny. What would you say if I told you he was going to rob your cousin? I'd say what problem has he got with my cousin. Hold on. Hey. Hey, hey, gorgeous. No. I can't talk right now. What are you wearing? No, I mean underneath it. Great. Listen, I'll call you back, huh? Sorry. Who was that? Never you mind. Was it Ivan? Ooh, that's funny. You know, for a dumb yokel, you're a very funny guy. <laughs> <laughs> yes, and for an annoying dick, you're really an annoying dick. Well, it's a real shame, then, that I'm the guy with the powerful friends, and you're the little punk who's only friends with some fat weasel who draws the fucking cap! So, why is Ivan going to rob my cousin? Because I want you to kill him. What? He's angered Mikhail, Mr. Paul. Offended him. He thinks he's stealing some paperwork from her mom. You catch him and kill him. Then we say it was just a robbery, that's it. And what if I say I don't want to be your hitman? <laughs> that Mr. Faustin will be very angry with you. And your cousin. Hmm. Okay. I knew we would understand each other once I put it in this simple way. Now! Go wait for him, but the car depot. Hey, gorgeous. Yeah, where were we? Okay, now listen. Let's talk about payment. I'll pay a fair market price that we control. Hard medication, my ass. Food. We have pills that can save your life, and you're whining about the cost? It makes me want to throw up. People have to take responsibility. I mean, just the other day, this woman began to freak out in front of me and clutch her chest. So I did the response. You're the guy I meant to kill? profits while our economy is in recession. Vlad ain't nobody! You're going to see that! What do you want us to do? Go out of business? Listen, it's easy. Invest. Then when our share prices go up because of the uh business. I thought everyone in this country was fat and slow! You trying to rob my cousin? Vlad's a bomb and set me up! Vlad don't like you no more, man! It's nothing in the stall! Don't do this to him! That's your fast one, aren't you? Project. out of roof, dickhead. Dispatch the unit from Biofy Project.
Ivan is dead. He came to a sticky end. Hey, you and your cousin's girlfriend should get together. She likes sticky finish as well. Fuck you! Say that to my face and I will break you! wrong? Hey, cousin. Bullshit. What's bullshit? Mallory. Oh, what about her? I like her. I really like her. But you keep messing around with other women. Yeah. No. I think she's messing around with Vlad. I saw his car parked outside her place the other day. Yeah. You knew? I had suspicions. You fucking knew? What was I going to say? You knew my woman was banging this warthog and you didn't do anything? I didn't, didn't say anything? I didn't know. You're an asshole, Nikobelik! A disloyal user! After what I did for you, you dick! You fucking dick! I'm sorry! Screw you! All right, so you want me to deal with it right now? No. Sit down. No! I'm not going to stand here and have you call me disloyal. You might let some Russian asswipe bang your woman, but I won't. But you fucking did! That was before I knew you cared! You always were a hypocrite. Nico, wait! Don't do anything stupid! Wait for me! Don't do anything stupid, cousin! Nothing as stupid as letting that fat swine give it to Mallory. Hey, it happens! I, we, we have an open relationship! I do my thing, she does hers, uh, maybe next time I might watch them at it! Oh, don't watch! Fat, hairy, sweaty back going up and down! I can't take it! How could she do this? I knew you cared. I have to do this. Wait, Nico, you have to think this through. Stay out here. Let the big boys have their conversation inside. Give it right. Anyway, I got it. Я говорю, про капусту. Зачем нужно жрать капусту, если есть картошка? Hey, картошка! Bloody boy! I'd like a word with you. What are you doing here? Did I summon you? Why? I told you to stay away from Mallory. Ah, go away! And now Roman is upset. Oh, Roman is upset. Excuse me. Do you think I give a fuck, peasant? Oh, there he is. Hey, fatty. I'm so sorry you're so upset. Oh, poor fucking whore. Hey, Vlad, can't oh, we just talk about this? <laughs> you stay away from Mallory. I must be hearing things. I could have sworn for a minute this ratty little yokel told me what to do. <laughs> Did you hear that voice? Yeah. Now, get them out of here. Come on, come on. Back outside, Roman. We are going to catch Vlad, Roman. Alright, he's running away. We win. Let's go home. 
I'm not walking away until this thing is finished. It is finished! He's running! We won't see him again! He'll come back. The only thing that will hold him down is six feet of dirt. Forget about Mallory. Plans change and, you know, when Vlad is done with her... Grow a fucking spine! You think Vlad will come after us when I am chasing him like this? I have to end it. Here and now. Shit, I don't like this. Fuck! Fuck! Keep your head down. I'm going to finish this. Stop, Nico! Shit! You fucking yokel! You think you can get away with killing me? I guess I'll find out! You think this is worth it? You are throwing you and your fatty cousin's lives away for that bit of Puerto Rican Georgia! I'm throwing your life away, prick! We'll do all right! My friends will track you down! You won't last a moment! I'll last longer than you will, shithead! Fuck you! I wish I could be there to watch Mikhail cut your peasant balls off! You've killed yourself and your cousin, Yokel. You are dead man. Mikhail falsely thought of me as a brother. He will get revenge. You are nothing in this city. You will be crashed. You've killed yourself and your cousin, Yokel. You are dead man. Mikhail Fausti thought of me as a brother. Half Beach is a small place. My friends will find you. You were the stupid one, Vladdy boy. Nobody fucks with my family. Ah, you're a big boy, Vladdy. Hey, go! Ah. Well, I guess this is over. What have you done? What does it look like? We're dead! No, he's dead. We're fine. He has powerful friends. Serious people. I told you to be calm! You all did the joke! I am calm. He tried to kill us. He screwed your girlfriend. What do you expect? I give him a massage? Shit! 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 When I was in the army, we were going on a mission. To ambush a squad would kill a lot of innocent people. They were our enemies. But we never did it. There were 15 of us, all boys from the village. But one of us betrayed the group. It was a setup. For money. Twelve people died, three escaped. I know the traitor was not me. So for ten years, I've been searching for the other two. One of them leaves here. Why are you telling me this now? Do you always get sentimental after you kill people? You kept asking. Wonderful! You're here on some revenge mission for something that happened ten years ago, and you don't care whose life you ruin in a way! No! Well, what? I don't know. I just want to know why they did it. Well, right now, I don't think you're going to find out. Let's hide the body, at least for a while. Put him in the river. <sighs> if you're fast, he's going to kill us! Shit! We should get out of here. You go. I'll catch up with you later.
It was given to me as an STD at a pool hall in Bulgaria, and I've been real thin and hallucinating ever since. But I am now just in the passageway between one world and the next, yelling answers back and forth. Do you understand? Probably not. Some of you will hear good news. Some no, of you I will hear bad news. All of you will hear the truth. So the guys at work think you're ridiculous because I listen to your show. There's three of them, isn't there? No, there's about eleven of them. I knew it! To ancient Egyptians, the number three was the number eleven. In the same way as the French word for spirit also means of a god. Did you know that? No, I don't quite understand. I really have never been to Egypt or France. Please, don't bring science into it. Doubters doubt everything. Personally, I'd rather know. Which would you rather be found? It is both, isn't it? Exactly. That was a trick question. You were named after Saint Michael. No! Nico! Nico! Are you there, cousin? Roman, I'm here. What are you doing? Why do you whisper? I am on Dr. Street. Your parents strike Come, Nico, quick! He's telling me he's very proud of you. He's saying you're a great and powerful man, only you don't know it yet. He's saying, he's saying the struggles you are going through at work are exactly the same struggles he went through when fighting the Moors. He was, you're right. But before he was in construction, he fought the Moors on horseback. Wow! Where are you, Roman? Psst, Nico! <laughs> Roman, what are you doing in the dumpster, man? Are they there? What are you talking about? Get out of there, man! I'm freaking out, man! I'm being followed! I saw them! Don't be ridiculous! You're being paranoid! I'm be... Fuck you! Fuck you! Everything was fine, and then you show up, and now we're dead, because Faustin is a psychopath. He's going to kill us, because we killed Vlad. Vlad was his man. That's how it works. You kill their guy, they kill you! Roman, get out of there, man. Listen to me. Vlad was a piece of trash. They don't care about him. All they care about is making money. So, we say we work for them. Now get out of there, you smell like cabbage. I don't want to, man. I'm shitting myself. Oh! Get out of the dumpster, Mr. Fat Man. Come on, Fatty. The boss wants a little chat. Uh, uh. Uh, wake oh. up! <laughs> we had to gag him to stop the screaming. You shouldn't have brought them here, Andre. Why not? <laughs> You've been a bad boy, Mr. Balkan. And the boss is not happy. Oh, no. I <laughs> shit my pants. Not yet, but you will. Who are you working for? Uh, my cousin, Roman. <laughs> Don't be an idiot. That's not good enough. I'm gonna saw off your fucking arm. Speak! Okay, okay. Your dad likes it up the ass. What do you want me to say, huh? Very funny. Do you think you're so smart? No! I tied up in the basement a long way from home, while some ape threatens me with a hacksaw. So no, I'm not that smart. Shut your fuck up! My fucking wife is watching television! Good lord. What are you doing? Nothing. I mean, I was finding out who he is. And? Who is he? He is his cousin. You were about to cut up some guy in my house making all that noise to find out he's his cousin. Where did you find this idiot? He was a friend of your sergeant when we were in Vladivostok. He's an imbecile. So, Nico Bellic, you think it's okay to kill my employees? If he is an asshole, yes. Do it! Oh. I agree. Real! <laughs> asshole, look at me like I'm a piece of shit. Bozo <laughs> moi. Now listen. Nico Bellic, you are very lucky Vlad was an idiot. The only reason I keep him around is because I fucked his sister. Look at me. You owe me. 
Yeah. I got some digheads in my neighborhood trying to run a ship, man. Yeah? And we found a buyer for the TVs. Yes, a buyer. But you got to get them for us so we can make the sale. Can you untie Roman? Хорошо. Shut up. Shut up. Hey! Roman, shut up. Shut up. Hey! Shut up, Roman. Hey! That's it. Hey! Roman, shut up. Shut up. Fuck. Oh. Oh. Shut up. Stop shooting people, you maniac. My wife doesn't like when people shout. Whatever. You better get those screens soon. Or I will personally pull your cousin's stitches out. One by one and watch his gut spill onto the floor. Clean this shit up. Listen, we'll take care of your cousin, but you better get a police car. And then you call me. Roman, Roman. Go, go, go. I, I'll take care of him. Fuck! the police car. What now? The van is driving around South Broker. Pull it over, take it to our lockup on Duke's drive. Be more specific. How many vans do you think there are in South Broker? That is a problem for you and your cousin, not me. Keep pulling vans over until you find the TVs. Goodbye. Get the fuck out of here. I don't want no trouble, buddy. What you got back there? TVs? Show me. <laughs> You're gonna be disappointed. Man, get out of here. out real slow, shithead. Listen, I don't got insurance. Are you carrying a shipment of TVs? No TVs, buddy. 
Fuck! Get out of here! Get out with no funny business. You're making a mistake. We're paying protection money to Kenny Petrovic. Open up the bag. You got any flat screens? You're gonna be sorry. Motherfucker! We have a fire on discharge on Mohawk Avenue. I got you now! I have visual contact! Invest. Then when our share prices go up because of the, uh, listen to this bit. Waste decades into training and meditating to speak to the other side. You can now take a shortcut right out of your online bank account. Hold on. It's telling me something. It's telling your luck will change if you spread knowledge. Buy 20 copies of my book. It's a clear message I'm getting from the depths of a different dimension. Will you do that? I'm sorry, you must have a bad connection. Interference with the spirit world happens. Are you ready to descend into the realms of Hades? I was there this morning. I've studied everything. Greece, Cyprus, Nepal, ancient religions, the pasts, sex magic, or the strength of the person afterwards? Fantastic! It answers really important questions. The number is 212360-2367. Hello, line 4. You have five minutes. The meter is running. Say, ah! I was wrong. It's okay. A little scarred, but okay. It's good. He 
Mikhail needs someone like you. Stop by and see him sometime. Hi, it's Nico. Nico Bell. Are you doing anything? You want to meet up? Yes. Pick me up in an hour. Great. I'm heading over to your place now. You are kissing him. What? Yes, you are kissing him with the tongue now. He is grabbing your long hair, shoving his tongue deep inside your mouth. You are really enjoying this. The passion is exploding. Your hand is reaching for his groin. Nico, hello. Roman, are you all right? I was just shot in the stomach and then stitched up in the doctor's office that was dirtier than the basement we were nearly tortured in. I'm great. You sound calm, actually. That Dimitri guy gave me some painkillers. I'm kind of out of it. If you're near a shop, can you pick up some adult diapers for me? See you later, Nico. 